So this is my APC backups or back UPS 700 and this is what it does when you switch it on. So it does a brief test. And then goes into an alarm state which indicates a faulty battery. APC say the battery should last three to five years and this one is um, just short of four years old so until fits that criteria uh, as laid down in the manual. Um, also in the manual it says that the um, battery is not user replaceable or user serviceable which I'm not quite sure why they say that and some people who've reviewed this uh, UPS on Amazon for example have sort of said you've got to throw it away when the uh, the battery runs out uh, that's not the case you can replace the battery yourself it's pretty straightforward so I'm going to show you how to do that so all you need for the job really is a medium Phillips screwdriver turn the UPS uh, upside down like this and remove these two screws here and here With the screws out and the UPS still upside down, you just slide the cover up like so and remove it and that reveals the battery. Once the two power cables are unplugged, you can just get hold of the battery and pull it out and that's all there is to it. So the replacement battery is uh, fairly standard, uh, 12 volt, 7 amp power, you can get these on eBay or Amazon, about 15 to 20 pounds. Uh, there are various different brands and capacities you can get, but this is a fairly typical one. As you can see, these two are the same orientation of connectors and markings and what have you. So all you need to do is ensure that you plug the red cable to the red or positive terminal and the black cable to the black or negative terminal, and that's it. So with the cables reconnected and the battery pushed all the way home, it should go in so with a sort of... Uh, maybe a 10 millimeter gap to give clearance for the front cover and then the front cover just slots back on and then refit the two screws and that should be the job finished so now that the mains is reconnected and we're back the right way up so if we power it on Give it a chance to do its quick test. Uh, so it's doing an inverter test now. So I did all, in the <coughs> with the failed battery, it had faulted by now, and there we go. That's it. Test complete. All good. Ready for another four years, hopefully. <laughs>